I don't know that there are specific goals to democratic capitalism. I think there's broad goals to democratic capitalism. What do we mean when we say that? We mean we don't actually know what's going to come next. But we, we, we and, and then let's take each word at a time. Democracy rep means representation. People have agency. I elect my uh, political representative to enforce the rules that I already agreed to, right, that are part of this. So democracy means that there's re political representation, which is a, a war against tyranny and oppression. Capitalism means privately decentralized people, private decentralized people decide how they're going to make their investments. And we have no idea what's going to come next. So living in a world of freedom means there's a lot of predictability in the rules of the place. But it means there's a lot of unpredictability in terms of knowing where the world is going to go. We don't know what the next invention is going to be. We don't know what life is going to look like in 20 years. That's exciting. It's exciting to not know. It's exciting to have people have the right incentives to be coming up with the next big ideas. Um, and so I think that's those are the broad goals of democratic capitalism. But they're, the goals are not specific other than protecting the rule of law, protecting people in their relationship against predation by the state, and protecting markets, allowing par markets to bloom.